All right, it's Monday, April 10th, 2023. Had a great weekend, you know, a lot of fun on Easter. Um, so last week, you can look at this a few different ways, because uh, it wasn't perfect by any means. Um, if you weigh myself, so throughout the week I've been weighing myself, the only weigh-ins that count, I'm not really worried about weigh-ins. But if you went from last Monday to this Monday, my total weight loss is right around four pounds. However, Easter was a long day. So if you went and checked my week, my weight on Thursday or Friday, um, it was actually six pounds. But I did, between the last couple days, I gained a couple pounds back. Um, a lot of that has to do with salt and water retention. Uh, I expect it to drop off really quick. But <clears throat> I did want to talk about Easter um, and kind of what happened. So I completely broke my diet. And when I say that, I mean completely in every way you can. Well, not every way. One way there wasn't. Um, but so my diet is, you know, fasting. It's an intermittent fast. So there are times I can eat. I completely broke that. Um, yesterday morning, I had a couple of homemade donuts my wife made. Um, <clears throat> and then we had Easter dinner around 2.30ish, 3 o'clock. Um, I didn't do too bad there, but I did eat probably more than I should have. And then I had a piece of cake when I was done. And then I did have some um, Easter candy, some uh, Cadbury eggs. So, um, but here's here's the the rub with that it's fine to take a break as long as you can handle getting back on it and i feel pretty comfortable that i can get back on it it's, it's monday morning and i feel confident that today i'm back on track so not too worried about that. Um, there's pretty much three three holidays a year where I kind of say it is what it is. So um, Easter, Thanksgiving, and Christmas. Those are three holidays where it's just, it's, it's to me, it's, you know, food is a big part of those celebrations. Um, and that's not necessarily because of the food, but I enjoy the food, so... Anyways, uh, another good thing that happened yesterday, which, uh, mind you, I, I, sorry, I'm getting hammered with emails. It's like this every morning at 5 a.m. Um, I'm not sponsored by anybody, I, obviously, um, but my wife got me a new water bottle for Easter, and it's one of those Kirkle things. I think, I honestly don't know how you say it, Circle? Is it Circle? Whatever. Um, it's... It's neat. I don't know how. I don't know how smart it is. Um, it's probably not real cost effective, but it's convenient, um, and it's pretty good for what it is. Like I was pretty shocked. Um, so um, it has this this whole piece up here is something you buy in the store. They're depending on where you get them three dollars and it's good for about depending on how sweet you like it six or seven refills of this um so when i look at what i was spending before on sodas which is the one thing i i told you i won't um the one thing i won't change that i won't fail at is any day is i won't drink soda ever again um that is the biggest addiction I've ever had is soda. So as much as I love Dr. Pepper, I'm, I'm done with it. Um, my cost per day for drinking Dr. Pepper was probably five or $6 a day. So it, it was a lot of money. Um, you know, I do a lot of these drink additives, which are, you know, three or four dollars and I like it a little bit sweeter than a single squeeze. So um, this probably lasts me a little bit longer than one of these. But I think I think this is a because of the convenience and the likelihood I'll remember it. Um, I think this is a better choice for me. So I'm gonna try this for a while. I'll let you guys know 
how it works out. Um, and sugar drinks are the devil. So, had a great Easter. Uh, this week, I'm really focused on making sure I'm back on track. Um, you know, today, I'm currently in my fast. Um, I will eat today probably around 5 o'clock is when I'll end my fast. I'm um, probably going to go heavy on the proteins for a few days. Just kind of help with the hunger stuff. And just see where it goes from there. So, I'm um, feeling upbeat. I feel healthy. Um, everyone probably thinks I'm chewing tobacco. I'm not. Um, sorry. It's a probiotic for my mouth. Um, I'm a firm believer in... I'm sure lots of people have this theory, but I call it the everything affects everything theory. <clears throat> so anytime you have anything that's out of balance or any kind of problem, it probably affects a lot of other areas. So I know your your oral hygiene health is very important. It can cause all kinds of issues with your heart and other things. So I'm really focusing on getting healthier in that aspect. So, you know, making sure you're brushing your teeth, making sure you're flossing, making sure you're doing the right things to keep your mouth healthy. Um, I'm just trying to make sure I'm covering all my bases. And I have a lot of other things to work on, trust me. Um, but I'm trying to knock off a, a little bit here and there. Um, I don't I don't really drink. I don't ever smoke. I've never smoked. I've, I've, I think I tried smoking once, but I, I, I don't like smoke in general. Um, but yeah, I just trying to do the right things. So anyways, got off topic there, but, um, I hope everyone had a great weekend and I will, if I don't see you again later this week, I'll definitely see you Monday next week and I hope you all have a great week.